Preserving the past while adapting for the future is a challenge for any small business owner. A young entrepreneur is doing that with one of Maine's oldest movie theaters. News Center's Beth McAvoy has the story. America has had a love affair with those images flickering across the silver screen for more than a century. Even movies are part of the movies. But with smart TVs, tablets, and of course phones streaming an endless array of movies, fewer people are actually going to theaters to see them. Welcome to the Levitt Theater and Levitt Lounge. Max Clayton is trying to change that. There's not really anyone older than the Levitt in a gunquit. The 33-year-old grew up in the theater playing among the original 500 wooden seats that are still there today. Sort of uh, grew up learning how to run these projectors. His father bought it in 1976. The theater was built in 1923 as a silent film theater. The first movie shown here, Dante's Inferno. Tickets probably cost around a nickel or a dime, but today, Max is offering them even cheaper. This is the first season we've been offering free movies. The free movie idea just came out of necessity. Uh, we just are trying to motivate people to come in and enjoy the theater. And nowadays, there's so much more to enjoy. In 2017, I took over and renovated the balcony of the theater and made a lounge and converted some of the seating into couches and tables and chairs, and we started serving food, got a liquor license, we have craft cocktails. The theater has been in his family for more than four decades, but his parents were thinking of selling it. We were getting the same uh, decline in attendance at the box office. So Max decided to throw the movie theater playbook out and try something new. We have live music four nights a week, we have a live comedy series, so every night we're open, we play a movie first, and then we transition to a bar with uh, live events. The night I visited, they were playing a free screening of Psycho. Everyone is reacting to each other. Watching a film together and the camaraderie that ensues is something Max says is lost in the digital age. We've all been there when something really funny in a film happens and everyone laughs, it just makes you laugh that much harder. Three years after opening the bar and lounge, things are looking up for the Levitt Theater. I'm basically trying my hardest to keep it here. In a gun quit. Beth McAvoy. I think that it's a gem. I don't think we can let it go. News Center, Maine. It is pretty rare to offer movies for free yeah. like that. And I love that he's, you know, thinking outside the box a little bit and having live music and so forth, really getting the most out of the theater. Good yeah. for him. So check out the theater's website for a calendar of those free movies and the shows that he talked about. We've posted a link to that in the 207 section of our website and mobile app.